Hello and welcome on board Queen Mary 2. Whether this is your first time on board a ship or you're new to travelling with Cunard or you just want to know how to make the most of your stay, this list of top tips will hopefully help you settle in. From finding your way around to keeping up to speed with all the various activities you'll find on board, these helpful hints aim to get your holiday off to a good start. So let's begin here in your stateroom. Your key card is invaluable. Not only does it open the door to your room, you'll also need to show it at the gangway when you're going ashore and also when you're rejoining the ship afterwards. Plus, it acts like a charge card while you're on board. Once you've registered a credit card or a cash deposit with the reception, you simply sign for any purchases you make on board, such as drinks, shop purchases and shore excursions. The card is magnetised, so please don't put it next to mobile phones or other electronic devices. And ladies, please take care to keep it away from any magnetic clasps in your handbag. For information about what's happening on board the ship, the daily programme delivered to you each evening should be your first port of call. It lists all the following day's activities, opening and closing times, upcoming port information, key highlights and dress codes, etc. I like to read it before I go to bed so I don't miss out on anything the following day and I find it's handy to carry with me as a reminder. Once you've unpacked, you may be interested to learn more about your home from home. Your stateroom folder contains all this information, plus details for making restaurant reservations, booking spa treatments, contact details for the medical centre and so on. There are also laundry and dry cleaning services at very reasonable prices. Self-service complimentary laundrettes are also available for washing and ironing. They are located on decks 4, 5, 6 and 8 and are open from 7.30am until 9pm each day. If you want to contact friends around the ship, phoning them is easy. Just dial the stateroom number you wish to reach and don't forget if there's something you're not sure about you can always ask your stateroom steward or stewardess. They're a great source of knowledge about life on board and they'll be happy to help you with any questions or requests you may have. Another great source of information is the ship's entertainment staff, who you'll often see around the ship running various events and activities and chatting with passengers. So Tommy, what's the first question everyone normally asks when they come on board? Well, they usually want help with finding their way around the ship, and there are some easy things to remember which will help you. First of all, if you're facing the front or bow of the ship, port is on your left and so are the even-numbered staterooms. For some passengers, this can be a quick and easy way of remembering where you are, as port, left and even all have four letters. The four stairwells on Queen Mary 2 are indicated by the letters A, B, C and D. Starting at the bow, we have stairwell A, and then stairwell B is midships, and stairwell C and D are towards the rear or aft of the ship. Broadly, you'll also find that the restaurants are at the back and the entertainment venues are at the front of the ship. Thanks, Tommy. That's really helpful. You'll also find handy pocket-sized deck plans in your keycard wallet, larger ship plans throughout the ship, and a list of all public rooms with deck numbers displayed in the lifts. And don't forget the purser's office located in the grand lobby on deck two is open 24 hours a day for any questions you might have. Well, here's another great source of daily information about what's going on aboard Queen Mary 2, the morning TV show hosted by the entertainment's director. You can find this show on channel 41 on your stateroom TV, which covers all the day's events and even the occasional interviews with guest speakers. Let's have a quick chat with someone who knows all about Cunard Entertainment for some more well, ideas on what I you might do today, on board. And so thank you so much for joining me and have a great day. Bye-bye for now, everybody. Bye-bye. Cut, thank you. Amanda, lovely to meet you. And you too. Thank you. Uh, so Amanda, you are the person to ask, what should we do when we come on board? Well, there are so many things to do here on board Queen Mary 2, but some of the most popular highlights include our incredible planetarium, which is located on deck 3L between A and B stairways. And this is extremely popular, so be sure to check the ticket collection times advertised in the daily programme. 
Another highlight is our maritime quest located throughout the ship's corridors and stairwells, which documents Cunard's proud history, including our Stars Aboard photo gallery on deck 3L forward, showcasing some of the biggest names of stage and screen who sailed with Cunard in the golden age of the transatlantic crossings. On the same deck, but further aft, you'll find the Clarendon Fine Art Gallery featuring original paintings and limited editions from around the world by uh, world-renowned names such as Fabian Perez and the face of modern British Impressionism, Cherie Valentine Danes. Definitely worth a look. Well, if you're more of a sports fan, head over to the Golden Lion Pub located on Deck 2, close to the Grand Lobby, for a great atmosphere and satellite reception permitting, many of the major live sporting events will be shown there. Then there's one of the highlights of many people's voyage and that's the Cunard Signature White Gloved Afternoon Tea. Now this is held between 3.30 and 4.30 every day in the Queen's Room, located aft, that is, at the back of Deck 3. There's also a champagne afternoon tea for a modest extra charge if you really want to celebrate in style. Be sure and make a reservation early though in your cruise because many people like to come back for this for a second time. Now we also run an intriguing behind the scenes or back of house tour where you can find out what goes into running a fantastic ship like this. There is a charge for this tour and spaces are limited so if you're interested it's worth reserving your place as soon as you can. Amanda that was great, thank you so much. Queen Mary 2 is a haven for shoppers with top exclusive brands available on board. Labels such as Harrods and H. Stern, as well as perfumes, cosmetics and a wide range of women's and menswear can be found at competitive, tax-free prices. There's also a kiosk where you can find everyday necessities and the odd item you've forgotten to pack. The shops and the kiosk are open every day with the exception of port days. With a wide range of both relaxing and more active tours at each destination you'll visit, the tours office team are there to take the hard work out of organising your time ashore, enabling you to pack in as many highlights as you choose. The tours office can also assist with airport transfers and private car requests. So James, tell us about the great excursions you can book on board. We've got a wonderful selection of tours designed with our passengers in mind, covering everything from cultural insights to scenic highlights. We use only reputable operators and of course on our organised tours, if there is an unexpected delay, the ship will never leave without you. All our excursions are graded by level of exertion, so you can choose the best tour for you and we're here every day if you want to come down for a chat and find out more. You'll find our opening hours in your daily programme if you'd like to consider the tour options at your leisure, just take a look at the tour leaflet that's delivered to your stateroom. It's easy to book outside desk opening hours, just pop your booking form into our drop box located by the tour office on deck two and we'll take care of the rest. We'll deliver your tickets straight to your stateroom. Well thank you James, it sounds like the only difficult bit is deciding which tour to choose. If like many Cunard guests you're looking forward to having time to relax and read, the impressive library has a wide array of the latest bestsellers plus some interesting reference books on the many destinations you'll visit. If you want to keep in touch with home, you can email from the Internet Centre and there's also Wi-Fi available in certain areas of the ship. Internet packages are available for purchase, 3G coverage is available in port and at sea, depending on your mobile operator and contract. But this is subject to the ship's position and satellite connectivity, which can sometimes result in slower speeds than you may be used to ashore. Please drop into Cunard Connections located on Deck 2 for any help or advice you may need when setting up your mobile devices for use on board. The team will be pleased to help you. Many people travel with Cunard because they have something to celebrate and on Queen Mary 2 celebrating is taken very seriously. Whether it's for your own celebration or someone else's, there's everything you'll need. 
Of course, there are greetings cards in the bookshop, wonderful shops for present ideas, an on-board florist, and even exclusive gift selections. You can celebrate in real style with exquisite dining in the outstanding Todd English restaurant, located on deck eight aft, which is really worth pushing the boat out for. Alternatively, relax over a special evening meal with waiter service at one of the themed dining options within the King's Court restaurants, located on Deck 7. You will need to book in advance and charges do apply. Now, what about being pampered in the serenity of the Canyon Ranch Spa? There's a fabulous range of indulgent options with the emphasis on health and well-being, from relaxing massages to gait analysis and foot care that will have you feeling like you're walking on air. You can also enjoy a day or full week pass to the specialist thermal suites and hydrotherapy pool, all in the most spectacular setting. With Cunard, every formal night is a special occasion and to look your best, you may want to book an appointment at the Hair and Beauty Salon located on Deck 7 forward. Demand on formal nights is high, so be sure to book early. Whatever the occasion, just choose the gift or memorable experience that's right for you. You can even renew your wedding vows during your time on board or get married at sea, but that takes a little more planning. Photographs are one of the most valuable mementos from your holiday. With this in mind, Cunard have come up with a few ways to help you capture the best of your holiday memories. Ask the professional photographers at Images, located here on deck 3L, to download your photographs from your own camera to disc or print. It's not expensive and will ensure you have a backup. If you're anything like me, you'll always come back from holiday with photographs of yourself or your partner but never the two of you together. But keep an eye out for the professional photographers at key events during the cruise and even on some tours, and they may just get that golden shot. There's never any obligation to buy, so it's worth giving them a smile. On formal nights, there are also portrait sessions against a backdrop for that perfect picture of you dressed in your finest. There are automated photo kiosks, which are available 24 hours a day, so you can view the photographs taken of you at any time. Just insert your keycard. Thank you. Choosing the right wines to go with the wonderful dining options on board is something to look forward to on any cruise with Cunard, and this has now been made even easier and even better value. Cunard wine packages offer a wide choice of whites, reds, rosés and sparkling wines. You can enjoy these fantastic wines at your dinner table, around the ship or even in your stateroom. Just ask any of the bar waiters or restaurant sommeliers for details or call the wine line, the numbers in the daily programme, to hear more about the onboard deals on both alcoholic and soft drinks packages. Many single travellers choose to sail with Cunard and there are a wide range of activities especially designed with these passengers in mind. As always, the daily programme is the best place to find out what's going on, but Queen Mary too also hosts a welcome reception on the first sea day led by the social hostess. Janice, lovely to meet you. So tell me, what can solo travellers look forward to on board? We have a variety of social activities specially planned for people travelling on their own. These include the welcome reception you mentioned on the first sea day, plus coffee and cookie mornings which take place every sea day, and especially organised meeting points for solo travellers going ashore on days in port. On our formal nights there's always a partner available for ladies wanting to dance the night away in the shape of our gentleman dance hosts. But as ever, check your daily programme for the details of the day's events. Thank you, Janice. Here on Queen Mary 2, younger guests are well looked after too. Cunard offer complimentary childcare during the day and evening in the children's clubs for your little ones. Be sure to drop by as soon as you can upon arrival to sign them up. Head to deck six aft. Older children are also expertly taken care of and you'll find a full list of the programme of activities in your stateroom, which will help you and your children plan your holiday. Do ask the youth team for books, 
arts and crafts and other items. They'll be happy to help. Don't miss the kids' teas hosted in the King's Court on Deck 7. But if you'd rather eat together, just ask for the full children's menu in the main restaurants. Your kids will also love the free ice cream available in the King's Court and the extensive selection of kids' TV programmes in your stateroom will keep everyone entertained. I hope that this film has been helpful and will help you make the most of your stay on board. For more information, do keep your daily programme to hand or feel free to inquire at the Purser's Office located in the Grand Lobby on Deck 2 and open 24 hours a day. Thanks again for choosing to sail with Cunard and have a great time on board Queen Mary 2.